Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to go over my March budget and how I ended up. Um, as you can see, I filled everything out already. Um, so let's just start with my income. So I have um, a few streams of revenue. Um, one is McDonald's, it's my full-time job. I also deliver for DoorDash and Grubhub. And then I just put other because um, you just never know. But so from McDonald's, I just said that I expected 1200 from McDonald's, 300 from DoorDash, 800 from Grubhub, and which brought a total of $2,300. So my actual income for the month ended up being $22,578.10, which is fantastic. Um, not right now. It Mom. is. Can you let me finish this and then I'll cut it up for you? Hey, Mom. What? Can you tell me anything? I need kiwi. Okay, let me finish this and then I'll come cut it up for you. Okay. Okay. Are we leaving it right here? Yeah. Okay. Um, so I did really well there. I was up $278. For my, um, we'll start with my fixed expenses. For my fixed expenses, I, um, that total was $1,241.74. And the three big parts of that is my phone bill, which is um, my phone, my mom's phone, and four tablets on there. One of the tablets is getting canceled soon, so that'll save $20.00. And then this included the last payment on my phone. So that also saves like another 30. So um, April's bill for the phone bill will already be done before I can cancel the tablet line. But um, because I keep putting it off. Um, so that one won't reflect that. But May's definitely will. And then um, my car payment and then the car insurance. And then so for variable expenses, I put my credit cards down here and their minimum payments, but these were all paid off in like at the end of February. So those were all at zero. And so I was over um, under budget for those. Um, the electric bill was $18 under budget. The city bill was 59 cents over. And then the only other place we were over was groceries, and that was a big, big overage. Um, but for the whole, for all of it, we were actually under by $272.51. And a big part of that is the daycare bill. I budgeted $120. They billed me for $79.40, but I have not paid that yet. But I forgot that I had already pulled that money out. So that is what you'll see here, which makes this less. Um, but I'd already done this before I did this. So I did the income minus my expenses. So I was $1,063.85 left over. But I did pay a big chunk of April's bills. It's like my bills for the first half of the month are already paid. And then what I need to keep pulled out for March's daycare bill. And then so that leaves me $288.55 left over. And... I'm either going to put that towards bills in April or just straight into my savings. I'm not 100% sure yet, so Kiwi is in my way. But I just kind of wanted to give you guys a quick recap of that. And I can't believe it is already April. Like, it is going so quick. But anyway, I'm going to end this here. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's weekly pay video. All right, thanks for watching. Bye, guys.